It's your girl Victoria and today I'm back with another video. So today's video is going to be a um, We're going to talk about the comments that I have under my video about how to become a DHK affiliate And we're also going to talk about a few items I didn't say they was from DHK, I'm just saying We're going to talk about them what kind of items And a few other things that y'all have in the comments So before we get into this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. And yeah, let's go ahead and get into the video. All right, so if you see me looking, it's because I'm looking at my phone so that I can pull up y'all comments because I know I got a few comments under these, under this uh, last video I made, which is doing pretty good. It's doing pretty decent. I posted it about a month ago. And I'm going to post it again on the screen. I posted it about a month ago. And it has like 800 or something. But y'all are really like tuning into it. So I like that. So I decided why not make a video answering the questions. Because it's different when you can actually hear me. And sometimes I'm not always able to get back to your comments. So yeah, let's do it like that. One girl said, what are the code words for? Okay. In that video, I had said that it was best if you're going to post about that kind of stuff start using and we're gonna call it the fence because that's what they call it on tiktok now if you're gonna start posting about the fence products and stuff like that start using those cold words like don't get on there and be like hey i'm posting a review for you know what i'm talking about just be like um use like the fence or use fence finds or Stuff like that because that is the new little code word they're using for um, that type of platform. That type of platform right now. So like on TikTok, you'll use it for your hashtags. On YouTube, you'll use it for your titles. So just little stuff like that. The next comment I have is, this is from Jay Carter. Hey there, thank you for the video. I have, I have seen your video first. I got reached out to about this and i recently signed up after watching the video you are saying to be careful is there any way you can elaborate on how i should be careful because girl i'm not trying to be banned on any of my platforms so when i say be careful i mean just like since i made the first video that's doing really good they have cracked down a lot on like us people who do those type of reviews um, I don't know the real reason why I could never tell you um, but they've they've been cracking out a lot so when I say be careful I mean just don't just be posting like go to my go to my link and buy this item like you need to be like if you're gonna say something about your link put like the link um, emoji and put bio like people gonna know if you put the link in the bio together that they mean like link in the bio like be sneaky with it almost don't just be like, oh, friend, like, I got this from such and such. I don't be like, I got this from the D. Be like, I got this from the fence or something like that. Uh, this is from Reagan Jackson. She says, what would you suggest if we bought our own products already, but we have a thousand followers to be able, but we don't have a thousand followers to be able to post the link in the bio to promote the product? Okay, so. I started off by just taking like a few items. I have bought my own items from the D already. And I was like, you know what? Let me just go ahead and do a review on it because I was already doing YouTube. So I was like, let's just make a content. And then it kind of blew for me. So if you already have your items and then you don't have the thousand followers, get on YouTube and promote it because you don't need a thousand followers to put a, a link in the description box or the comments or tell everybody i know sometimes i would tell everybody to go to my instagram and i'll dm you the link so you had to dm me which brought more content well which brought more supporters and followers and then bought more watch revenue and all kind of stuff like that put me in the algorithm because you had to come to my page so they was kind of pushing my page like that 
candy cases so i messaged them personally and they're telling me to apply for online celebrity sample directly in the store how do i do that i don't know anything about the online celebrity i don't know nothing about that i usually just the way on the first video so i'm gonna post the first video on the in the link at the top just go to the samples regular samples and apply for those i don't know nothing about no celebrity samples mariah Lachey, I hope I said that right. She said, hi, I just started. I've been waiting for them to approve one sample for weeks and nothing. I've also seen people talking about a Z manager. How could I get one of those? So when you sign up, okay, so you have to think, a lot of people are signing up under my link. I left my link in my description box and I'm gonna leave it in there again. For you to go ahead and sign up but a lot of people have been signing up with their link and i have one manager her name is rita so she does all of my stuff but you got to think like if too much people are signing up like in a day then that becomes a lot so i i don't know and i can get that information i don't know how they're going to do it like if they're going to assign you a new manager but um rita should be a part of your management crew or whatever the case may be and back to the product it took i don't i don't know how long it took me to get an item approved like my first item was some item that i don't even know what it's about but don't apply for those that say you have to have like ten thousand five apply for the really small ones like something for five thousand but put your best okay so when you sign up they make you link a platform put your best platform under the link because companies click on your platform before they approve anything so put 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 your best platform when you sign up. And you can go back and change that now. Like if you put just a regular platform, go back. Go back and put the one that gets the best views, like the most views and stuff like that. I'm going to kind of skip some because some are kind of repetitive as well. Um, Alyssa McCoy says, hi, so my sample went from pending to cancel. Does that mean I didn't get approved? Yes, that means you did not get approved for the sample and that means you have to go in and apply for another sample. And for you to, okay, so they switched the samples from five samples, because when I first signed up, I was getting five samples. They switched that from five to one. Why, I really don't know. I guess because people are getting stuff and not reviewing it. But they switched it from five to one. So when you get that one sample, if they don't cancel it, you cannot apply for another sample until that product is canceled. So, yes, if it says pending and then it says, because I have a lot that say cancel. Like when I try to apply for like, they have drones on there. And when I try to apply for like, to get an item like sometimes i won't qualify depending on who the seller is some sellers will reach out and be like hey can you send me your page directly so i could go through it and stuff like that but sometimes i don't always qualify so yes when it says cancel it means you are not approved that girl shania says how do i contact your affiliate manager i don't know who mine is so i kind of spoke on it earlier but if like once you start doing it they'll be you have to check your um don't sign up with an email where you can't check the email because they'll read it when i first heard about first i had a first i had one manager at first and then i canceled him and i think i got read him i i this has been in a long time so they're they gonna contact you through your email and then rita ended up finding my instagram or i told her about my instagram and then we did it like that but i've had multiple people reach out since then to ask for me to get under their um their contract or whatever it's not really a contract because you're not signing nothing but under there you know they're stuck so i can review under their stuff and then i guess they get commissioned they'll help push stuff give me stuff whatever but i've also turned those down because i already have read um so just be checking your email um i will post rita's uh instagram right here because a lot of people want to know who is rita and can she inbox you so I'm gonna put read the email right here in the description box so you guys can email her and check it out. But I want to show you some of the products you can get from the fence. 
my first item is this right here. So I just got this in. So it still has all of the plastic on it. It's really cute. I cannot wait to wear this. This is one of the bags. Can y'all see how cute this is? This is the cutest bag ever. I got some shoes, some pink shoes that's gonna go with this. It's everything, it's giving a lot of life. Let me show you the inside. This is the inside, not very spacious. It's very compact right here. It comes with a crossbody strap. I'm so excited to wear this. I don't even know why I'm gonna wear this too, but I'm gonna wear this with an outfit. And you click it right here. This came in a box like this. And inside the box came a dust bag. So that was one of the items. Let me show you my next item. So this is my next item, super cute. And this is how it comes in the inside. Now let me tell you, they're, they update, the Fizz is updating their um, packaging because usually the packages becoming like um, damaged, like if you have a dents and stuff in them. This one, these few boxes I've been receiving doesn't have any dents in them. Look at it. Play with it, don't play with it. It's really, really cute. This is what the back looks like. Now, truly, 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 I'm not sure. I really didn't know how I felt at first because this is really hot pink and this is like a, a, a peach color. I don't know if you can tell. I didn't know how I felt at first, but it's still cute. It's giving right now. It's giving it, girl. Inside this box, it came with this dust bag. So that is that. This is the next item. Look how cute. It's really pink. Don't think it's purple. Well, I don't know. It's kind of giving purple. Look at the detail on there. This is a bag. Now see, I just, I feel like the purse is made wrong. I feel like the purse, but see, it kind of drops low at the bottom, but I guess, I don't know. In the inside, it is silk, silk pink. And it comes with some cards. And they have a strap with it as well. Like I'm just really getting these products in like recently I just got these recently I just got these products in so it comes with this um, light pink strap next item is this bag right here it's so cute I understand why is this so wide I don't like that uh, let me go ahead and close the back up so this one has a little tag that comes with it And we have the straps right here. Comes with the card. I mean, they really honestly try to make it look as legit as possible. This is the inside. It comes with the zipper pouch right here. It's cute. I think I'm gonna leave it like, it. I thought this was a design, but I guess it's supposed to come out. I'm gonna call this the It Girl Collection because it's giving It Girl. 